most popular dang eight million that's a lot all right um all right so now i get out with you that's crazy i guess right, how so smooth that was that's why people liking it because it's just a smooth transition like walked up to the cat dapped them up and all that and it was just smooth like i didn't expect it to go that viral ESPN about the uh post it uh puberty however you say it um it's so it's crazy like I got like at least 20 million 25 million views on that video between all platforms that's insane I'm gonna keep it going though all right Sloan I came back with that pack my boy look I got some goods for you it's that Rocking real Zaz. green what they call it Zaz. look these cat videos are the ones that really popped off though smell it good all right Excuse me, I'm not even busy, but I got one this question. What's the best thing that we can do to stop this from happening tonight? Just go home? Yeah. Just go home? Yeah. He said go home. Hey, hey, they're, making us, they're making us look bad, bro. This is nothing to do with the protest, man. So, Thank you for doing what you're doing, man. Thank you, man. For real, bro. So, Excuse me, I know you're busy, but I got one question. What's the best? So basically, it was people coming from out of town and instigating the protest and trying to start a riot. In Detroit, when people in Detroit wasn't really trying to riot, it was just protesting. Now, the media was saying it was Detroiters. And it was like, everybody in the news was like, oh, it's some black people, animals, blah, blah, blah. But it really wasn't. It wasn't Detroiters. It was people from like Ann Arbor, people from out of town, really trying to do all that. I was trying to eat that with a spoon. Horrible idea. So it was really people from out of town. That's why I asked, like, yo, how can we stop this? Because it was going to turn into a ride eventually. But I was just like, man, it ain't even got to be like that for real. So that's what that was. This was 2020 during the George Floyd protest. That was crazy. That was crazy. All right, so I'm going to get out with you. All right, I'm going to fuck with you. All right, bro. Classic man. A little escrow. By the way, escrow got shot like four times, but he survived. It was crazy. I get escrows really like that. He ain't no Slim Jesus, I get. I guess. You know, Slim Jesus was supposed to be about that life, but he was really a kid from Cleveland. It was just his story crazy. About this video crazy. Hey, hey, ready? Ready? Oh, bro, tweaking. Shooter ready. Ready. Let's do it. I'm Hi. reacting to a reaction. Bro, what? What? You see how big that damage was? That was insane. My reaction to that was crazy. I was just like, Dog. what? Not once, but twice. He must Bro, be confident. I know that. I know they made some money from that, but it's not worth it to me. It's not worth it. Perfect. I know he made some money from that. No one protects you better. Selling them trucks. To get shot at with a fifty cal. It's not worth it though. Would you do that? Bro, tweaking. Shooter ready. Ready. Let's do it. Like that's insane. I'm still confused about that. That's insane. Like the impact, All right, so now I get up the impact the alone could have gave him brain damage and messed him up. That's why I'm like, bro, I really don't understand it. Like, if he would have got hit by that 50 cal, he wouldn't have knew that he got hit. Like, the dog would have just been gone. But them snipers ain't no joke, man. Ooh, we. But at least you know if you get hit with that, it's over. It ain't no pain, no suffering. I drove the most dangerous car you can own in Detroit. Even though I told myself I'd never drive one of these in Detroit, I ended up doing it, and it was one that of the best cars car. that I ever drove. Now, you got all types of challengers, but what's going on with bro challenge? Yeah, that was weird. I'm still trying to figure out. I think it was the wheels, probably. But that boy, do look. it looked like built, like somebody built that boy out of a cardboard box or something like that. I ain't never seen no challenger like that. That is crazy. And in the hood, the hood be having the most interesting things, most creative. Like, I, I still would never understand. It's like the top is a decent size, but then it's the car that make it look just out of proportion. It's lower. Yeah, that's that's crazy. I drove. Well, I was messing with Detroit Dust. But I didn't want him to try to twist my arm, so I just gave him the knife. That's why it was funny. <laughs> He gave me that nervous laugh towards the end. Look at that. He's like, what's going on? Because I'm a wild guy. He was looking at me like, what is Trey on? 
But I don't want him to try to grab because he be doing all that like locking, like arm locks and all that. But we have a part where we was about to start boxing. He like, oh yeah. But he be doing all the like tricks to take knives out. So I was like, man, I ain't about to play with bro like that. All right, what's going on here again? Okay, what's, oh, the police chasing her out. He trying to get on the week. Stop filming me. Oh, she mad. Police. I ain't gonna cap her only fans probably went up after that. That's why it always be every time a little controversy right, happens. Okay, what's they always feel like teacher gets fired for only fans. They they always still go up anyway though, like it's crazy. My video I did a viral right, video. Homeboy I said, what we gotta do to not ride. You said go home and the people loved it. We got like four, mm. two million views on a video that I posted. You said me? Yeah. That was a genuine reaction. He ain't know his popping. I said what well, we got See, people video, be thinking I'm out here trying to expose police. But when you cool, like, bro, he get a lot of love in the community because he genuine. He a vet. I think he about, like, about to retire and all that. Bro, look at these people over here. Dude, what does it look like the hood to y'all? We got, like, four. Make this guy go viral, man. He's on a video that I pulled. So people, people was talking video, crazy said, about the black video, people, like, oh, they turned into Detroit. Look at the people that wasn't really out there. You said go home. And the people love that we got like four, two million. Oh, I see a couple, but still, they was putting the blame on the hood, like, bro. I see Mad Max cars and all that. Man, he's helping. Uh, we fighting for peace out here. Look, he's busy. He's like, hold on, he's Yeah, and he's helping uh, patrol the city. Hey, dog, <laughs> hold on, hey. Listen. This is a new page, so a lot of these videos will be the cat video. And you own a car like this in the hood. Here are three things that I learned having a Mustang in Detroit for a week. Number one, don't be at the grimy liquor stores People always and gas do that, stations at night by yourself. Number two, no matter where you live, I recommend having a license to carry a firearm. Number three, if you're parking at night somewhere, make sure you're parking in the gate or having a wheel lock. Even though I get a lot of attention in this car, most people just appreciate it. And they really looking for the hell cats and the scat packs to take. So if you got a Mustang, oh, I think you man. You looking nice. That bulletproof real? That's Billy Prefer. I need to start watching my videos before I post them. It's crazy. I just realized now I'm be watching my videos before I post them. It's bad. I'm gonna edit it. Alright, let me show. I know that's wild. Oh my god. I'm feeling bulletproof. Oh, let me hit my dance. Looking for a drink, so. Hey, bro, I'm trying to record a video uh, for TikTok, like a remix or something. Can you hold the camera for me? Yeah, yeah. All right, good looking, good looking. Yo, yeah, he's got a hood on. Flint, Detroit. Let's go. I done done a lot of things in my life. I should have been in jail. Hey, to sit me up on the daily. Say I'm finna fail. Body slam him if I see him in public. Oh, well. Caught messing with a real one. I bet he go in jail. Trapping with this bitch. Building clientele. Building clientele. Drake back I bet I leave a trail. Beast. I bet I leave a trail. Kill my homie. I seen him chopping shells. I seen him chopping shells. Running up the bag like I'm Sonic and I'm on their tails. It was a bop, though. Bro, Jack Funny is hilarious. Why the fuck he keep looking? Why is he looking at me, dog? <laughs> Why the fuck you keep looking at me? Stop staring at me. Niggas is only like a dollar, so it's gonna fill you up if you hungry for it. So, ooh, you know, I get chips. He said I get chips. That I did not expect that to happen. He popped up right now. Because you're on a caffeine and nicotine. Oh, hold on. Worst thing to do with a gun. Bros, to be walking like this with it tucked in a belt. Would you trying to get cheddar bobbed or something, bro? Listen, whenever I see Y'all know who cheddar bobbed is from 8 Mile. Tucked like, like this with no holster, bro. Listen, I get it. You thug, dog. You a savage. You a goon. Can't nobody play with you. But listen, if you trying to run up on me and you got it all up in your drawers and like, look, look, look. If it's all, if it, if it's all in the drawers like that. You know what I mean? People do be dropping their guns and having them stuck. It can fall, bro. It's a video I seen of a uh, guy pistol like falling down in the store and it like fell and then the police just tackled him. When you got to do all that, like when I say cheddar vibe, you try to pull it out, you know, you're going to hit that trigger, boom, you, it's over. Even when I was in the right, streets, I never just had my gun in my drawers like that. You know what I mean? Quick draw, real quick. So I don't know. It is what it is. If that's what you want to do to feel tough. And I got a Glock, so I can yeah, You feel me? But when you're dealing with somebody that's probably you know, trained, it can go bad for you. Like I don't have thugs you know what i mean and tough guys try to you know what i mean try to press up but it ain't about how tough you is how many times you don't got shot all that it's about who get their weapon first and got the proper training and the proper aim 
Now, come on. What you think? Off the barbecue. Check the video. Make sure you still good.